Hello everyone, Raven here, and today's video is a spotlight video on Winona. And I'm actually, I was pretty hyped for this character. I don't want to start the video off kind of sour and negative, but after messing around with her and just reading through her uh, abilities and stuff, she's not as good as I thought she would be. I feel like she already needs a buff. All right, hear me out here. Before you dislike this video, call me a piece of shit. I'm, I'm definitely happy we have a new character, someone we could mess around with, but the thing is, I only found one thing that's kind of good with her, and it's just can be avoided and that's her she could take one free shot from charlie so i messed around with it you can see here and so it, i was trying to figure out is it a time based and it's not you could just literally put your like hold a torch out or any light source and you could just turn it on turn it off get hit turn it back on for a split second turn it off and then you could keep getting hit and never take damage so that's kind of cool but i mean that could be avoided right like you could easily avoid not getting hit by charlie Usually when you get hit by Charlie, it's because you, like, kind of, I would say it's more on, like, a mistake, right? You weren't paying attention, or, like, you're like, oh, crap, I, I gotta make another torch, so you get hit once or something. So that's kind of nice, but overall, I just feel like with taking one hit from Charlie perk is, I mean, that could be avoided, man. So let's talk about her trusty tape. So when starting out, you get three trusty tape, and basically these are sewing kits, and each trusty tape has one use so you can see here after I repair something it gets one use and it's not a full heal it seems to do similar healing percentages as the sewing kit but even though it only gets one use per piece of tape that's not too big of a deal just because it's super cheap to make like the difference you could see here is kind of a lot compared to the sewing kit I just really wish it worked on armor but it doesn't Cause then it would make her kind of like a wig for it. I don't know, I'm, I feel a little sour about it. I mean, I, I feel like it would be really good if it worked on armor. Like, at least that would be like dope. But unfortunately, it only works on clothing. To top it off, the only other thing she could do is her skilled builder, she could build things a split second, like half a second, 0.5 seconds faster than any other character in the game, which I, everyone else builds one second to build craft items. She could build half that. Like, why not just make an instant? She could build instant. Wouldn't that make sense? Like, that's a stupid. That triggers me, people. That triggers me. Ugh, I don't know, guys. I don't know about this anymore. But I think she's... I mean, her health and everything is the same as Wilson, so at least that's kind of nice. Um, she doesn't really have any downsides, so that's another plus. But besides that, there's not really much going for her. I mean, I'm so happy we got another character. I'm going to do some more messing around. Let me know in the... Um, you know, fight me on this. Let me know what are some good things you found. I'm sure she's going to be changed a lot. For a minute, I actually one-shot at a hound. So I'm like, wow, did she do more damage than normal? But nah, she doesn't. I think it was just a bug. Because uh, when I one-shot that fire hound here, I couldn't figure out how to make more trusty tape. And so I reset the game and there was another update. And then after that, maybe there was something to screw with her damage. And they also added the trusty tape for build. So nope, she's not stronger in any way. But that would, that would kind of make sense, right? She's like, you know, look at those guns on her. Why can't she do a little bit more damage than normal? That'd be nice. I just really wish her tape repaired armor. Why can't they give that to us? That would be so nice to have something in the game that did that. Because how, how many times you got some armor that's like 1% or a couple percent and it's just not worth holding on you, you know? It'd be nice if there was a character, you know, that'd be a pretty good perk to she, her sewing kick of work on that. It'd be kind of like a Wickford in a way, you know? People would pick her because she's like, damn, she has some dope sewing kits, man. But she just has the basic sewing kit. <laughs> and yeah, there's really not much more to her as far as I know. <sighs> I'm going to end the video right here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think of the new character. Is it just me? Do I, am I the only one? F I mean, I don't know. Just let me know what you guys think about the new character. I'm a little sour about how it turned out. I hope we could see some buffs in the future, but it doesn't seem like Clay messes around with that kind of thing too often. Um, what I would like to see is just if their tape can be used on armor, that'd be awesome. I think that'd be super cool. I think that'd be a nice buff. Maybe even make it cost more. Um, I think it'd still be worth, but can't I, but then that's the thing too. It can't cost too much or else you might as well just make a new piece of armor, right? And you might as well make her crafting instant. Like, come on. 
slightly, uh, just a half a second, like 0 0.5, like half a second faster. Just make it instant. Come on, man. I mean, the Charlie thing's all right. I don't really see anything to change about that. That could be useful for some people, I guess. But yeah, just let me know what you'd like to see. Maybe some different stuff or like how they could rework this character a little bit better. And I'll see you guys next time.